Nicely played. Intentional. Four. But it doesn't make a difference. There's a long arm. There he's got over the top. Go for it. That is huge. Oh, yes. And there's another one. But that's gone very high. Lovely placement. Just over the field at point. Gets the 100. Oh, that's four. Oh, what a shot. Six ball. Lovely shot. Risty. Four more. Oh, Tarsen, he's flicked that away for four. But here's Sevak. He's cut that. Has he got it through? He has. 200 runs for Gurinder Sevak. Now becomes the highest scorer ever in ODIs. 201. What a performance. Awesome batting display. Oh, that's a six. Short and wide. Oh, that's in the air that he hasn't got a hold of. Fielder under it. Takes it. Martin takes the catch. Virinda Sehwag departs for 219. And look at that. Every West Indian fielder running from whichever position he is in to shake hands of the new record holder in a one-day cricket. All of them from different parts of the ground. And the highest now in limited overs cricket is 219. Yes, I've got the uh, champion with me, Viru. You're not even uh, panting at the moment. You've had 10 minutes uh, break, but what an effort. Did you dream of it? Never, because uh, I was telling myself and Gautam Gambhir, if we batted little patience, we'll show some patience, then maybe we can score a big one here because wicket is good to bat on, outfield is fantastic and the boundaries are you know almost 50, 50 yards. So we just show some patience and if we, we look to bat uh, at least 30 overs, then we can we can score some runs. But I was not expecting this 200. I I must say thanks to Mr. Ranbir Singh Chaudhary who SMSed me that you know when I got out in 20, he said you missed your 100 here and make sure when next time you get start, you convert in 100. And so thank you very much, sir. You know, what I want to say is if you ask people around the world and they say which man should be having a double 100 in a test match in a one day international, they would say Chris Gale over in the Seva. So now you've done it, 219. Uh, a phenomenal effort, but good batting conditions. Yeah, absolutely. There's a true batting wicket, and you know, you just, just uh, spend a little bit of time and just carry on with your shots. and. Whenever, wherever I was just hitting the ball, you know, into the gaps, go for four. And when I decided I want to hit a six, I'll just try to hit it, uh, you know, with, with straight bat and go for six. So I think, yeah, everybody was expected from me to score double under. I, I think I live on uh, on expectations. So, so thanks to everyone, thanks to my fans, especially my family, you know, who supported me all the time. A very determined Virendra Sehwag today, as uh, opposed to the first three games. You could see it in your eyes, you could see it in your body language. Yeah, we have to because we have to give our stars. Because last uh, last match, I, I said in presentation that you know our top order was not contributing, and it's uh, my job and and the other guys' job to you know give a good start to the team. So you can't expect uh, you know that kind of start from from anybody. But when the moment you give this kind of start, you end up with 400. Minutes. When did you start thinking 200? And did that change your style of play? Uh, never, because I was uh, playing my shots throughout the inning. So I, I, I thought it when, when I was batting in the batting power play. So I thought if, if I just bat this power play, maybe I'll, I'll cross that uh, 200 mark. And, and I did. And when the when uh, Sami dropped my catch, I thought that you know God is with me. So God is telling me that you know you just just bat uh, till 45th, uh, 46th hour, so you will achieve your 100, 200. And physically, how how were you coping up? Yeah, right now I'm very much very tired because I'm 30 year old old man and my back and glutes are tight. So, so hopefully I'll go and take ice bath and you know, get back onto the field. You're an old man, but you're precious and a brilliant innings today, Viru. Thank you very much. Sir.